Hi guys, welcome to another um, airport update. Uh, this time it's going to be an unboxing. Uh, I know you haven't heard from me in a while. It's because I was a bit busy and just didn't really have time. I remember I told you about the moving. I moved into a new apartment. Uh, I can see the floor is different. Uh, not only the floor, there are a lot of different things here, but uh, that's not about it. I'm gonna maybe do like an update about what's going on later. Uh, there's another big arrival that arrived like three weeks ago. I opened it a bit, but didn't really have time to uh, look into it more. I'm gonna make an uh, unboxing about it too. Uh, although it's unboxed, I'm gonna like put it together so you have a full experience. But today we're unboxing those three models, uh, Gemini Jets, Max, Lockheed, uh, C-130H, uh, that's Belgian Air Force in a special Belgian Air, special 20 Airs colors. Uh, like something like this, oops, like this. We've got the specification, the box, the classic Max, old, the cast box, uh, yeah. I'm going to be back with that when we open it. Then we have uh, ground uh, support vehicles um, with all of those. The box untouched, just like it arrived. Um, yeah, I have four sets of those already, so it's not my first set. I don't remember, though, having the stickers in the back, so we'll check those out. I never had the smaller ones. In the back, and this is a very interesting model. NG models, Xi'an Y20, Kun Peng City, uh, to, with the number 242 on the side. People's Liberation. Let me take it. Let me focus it. People's Liberation Army Air Force. It's the Chinese Air Force. If someone did not get that yet, box pretty interesting. I never had an NG model in my hands before, so it's my first time. Uh, box pretty nice, pretty good. So yeah, let me open them and I'll see you back in about so, three minutes. So I'm back after a couple of seconds, uh, maybe a second for you, about three minutes for me. Um, I don't know, let's start maybe with those. Um, I'm just gonna look at the stickers because I, I had the stickers like from the terminal, uh, from from different like, terminals, the new as well. There are a lot of stickers, but I never had it from the. Um, so, just to mention about the stickers, uh, never had those before, like small format like this. I think they might have done them again, because I don't remember all of the. Um, I don't remember South. Yeah, I remember Southwest, they had the old, the really old terminal. So that's a bit different. Then here are those, there's not much. I'm not gonna take them out of the box. I'm gonna put it in my uh, case because I've got like a box with all of those. Uh, so there's not much really show with those. They look good. Uh, yeah, that's it about those. Uh, now the models. Um, here's the Xion y Y20. So let's pick it up and see how it looks like wow oh, it's a big model if you can't see it the box itself is very similar size to the one that the c30 is backed in but the model itself it's huge and it's pretty nice to be honest It's pretty nice. I can't get it to focus though. Hmm. Now it focused. The wheels look good. The engines look good. Um, the engines are a pretty important part for me. At least. Uh, the tail looks good. And it, the model is pretty heavy also. So, yeah. Now, let's see the uh, C-130. Um, hmm. So, this is the C-130. Uh, yeah, those are spinning. The wheels, 
This is an interesting part. I never saw them being like this. Like the the bottom looks different. The wheels look different. Uh, it has the sides, then we also have the colors are interesting. It's the Belgian special 20 years livery, which is pretty interesting, not gonna lie. Um, then the engines are actually made done pretty well. I enjoy looking at those, and the model itself is done pretty nicely just um, here on the wings you can see the white parts not sure if it's supposed to be like this because the back of both wings is nicely done but their front um, not talking about the engines but just the way the colors are transformed into different yeah just the colors are changing and here right here you can see that white part that's that's not supposed to be there I guess it's hard for them to make the colors, but it's a separate parts uh, part. So they put the wings here as a separate part, so it should not be that hard for them. Uh, but as you can see, they had some problem with that. It still is a very nice model. So that would be it for today. Uh, thank you for watching, and I hope to have the airport updates up soon again. See you next time. Bye.